What's going on everyone? Welcome back to some more Fortnite. Today we are doing the Sky Bridge Challenge and these challenges always make me very nervous. I'm talking sweaty palms, mom spaghetti, the whole nine yards. But uh, if you guys like these type of challenges, can we get 2,000 thumbs up on this video? And speaking of thumbs up, I need your suggestions. If you're going to leave a suggestion for the next challenge, let me know down in the comments. Be creative, be outside of the box so that I can pick it up, we can do it, and I can try to complete it for you guys. And if you like somebody else's comment, please thumb that up too. But don't forget to thumbs up the video. Let's jump right into the gameplay. All right, today we are going to Moisty Meyer. That is the key, the goal, the one and only Moisty Meyer. Now, this is actually a really good setup we got going on here. Because if we can get to Moisty with no problem, we might have to stretch it just a little bit, which is okay, because usually that makes where people can't get there with us. But the trees in Moisty Meyer give you like. I want to say 90 to 115 wood, somewhere around there, and nothing, uh, I don't think that's exact numbers, but uh, it's pretty close. But for every tree, big tree, that with the bright green tops that you see there, I shouldn't say bright green, like the hunter green uh, tops that you see there, we're going to be able to get 90 to 115 wood. And that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to knock out all those big ones, and we're trying to avoid people a little bit this time. Um, we probably won't get a lot of kills. But that's okay, that's not the goal. The goal is the Sky Bridge Challenge. Now, we're gonna get uh, into the, uh, basically the final zone. Uh, we're gonna be at the very top of the world as you can get. And uh, also, we're gonna try to get 999 brick if we can. If we can't, that's okay. Uh, as long as we get wood, we should be okay. But we need a little bit of something else. We can get iron or whatever else. And we got a really crappy spawn with the chest here. And I got a three burst. I hate three bursts. Those bricks are gonna come in handy though. So anything we can take. So there's a little bit of loot around these things. Also these little bitty uh, cabins with stilts on them. You can grab those as well. And some of these trees are hollow and you can grab stuff out of those as well. Um, and the main thing you need to know is go for the big trees first and then work on the little trees. The little stumps that are actually above the ground that you see here. Uh, grab those if they're in your way just because it's a really quick way to get you know 30 to 40 type of wood that one wasn't too great it only gave us 23 but uh, overall I mean it kind of adds up as we go but the main ones we're trying to get to of course are these huge ones and another another triple bullet first voice um, the guns we're looking for we're looking for a regular AR we're looking for um, a sniper that is the main key is the sniper if you can get a sniper you can win the game from your sky bridge um, also bandages that's the three main things you need you need an AR in case we run into anybody else uh, we need a sniper for when we get on the bridge and then you need bandages because I'll show you what to do with bandages in just a little bit if we get there but uh, yeah those are the main three things you need uh, you may not need the bandages, but they are very important in case you kind of get um, in a crappy, crappy spot with uh, fighting other people. And the whole thing about this thing is being very, very sneaky. If you can be sneaky throughout the whole thing, then we're going to be just fine. And I'll kind of show you guys to help your percentages of being sneaky on this whole challenge as well. And uh, yeah, and if you complete this challenge, uh, please send me a screenshot. I would love to see the screenshots on this one. Uh, just your final end score where you are and then, you know, your final kills and all that stuff, that, that'd be cool. But uh, yeah, these right here, 29, not too bad, not great, but not too bad. And that one was only 20, but um, usually there's a chest right up here. We're gonna see if that chest is here. And then there's usually a chest on the ground on the back side of this thing too, so we'll see. But this tree right here, don't forget about it. Yeah, I hear it, it's right here. And we got bandages, so that's good. Bandages are always a good thing. I'm not going to pick up any of the SMGs or pistols. Uh, I'm picking up grenades for right now just in case I get in a fight, but I will switch my grenades out as soon as I can. And I'll also try to switch out my triple burst for ARs, um, regular ARs if I can as well. But yeah, this is the other one I was talking about right here. And as you can tell, we're already at 900 wood, which is exactly where we want to be. We want to head towards the circle a little bit, but also be there. And we got a boogie bomb. I... Really like that we get a boogie bomb too. This will help us. Okay. What? Okay. I've left it. Okay. Um, yeah, the boogie bomb will help us. I would love to get a final kill with the boogie bomb. It's just not very realistic. 
Uh, and I don't know if it travels very well in the air. I know, it, 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 I think it has to hit ground for it to go off. Plus, it's only five seconds. If we're way up there, I mean, you're going to have to hit directly and then get to kill. It's going to be almost impossible. But, uh, I mean, if we get to that point, I will try it. But uh, we're going to use it to kill other people in the meantime. So I'm not afraid to use the Boogie Bomb in this situation. All right. So we basically have our wood. We're good on that. Now we're going to the next spot, which is one of my favorite spots in the game, right up here to the quarry. There's two quarries around the farms here. Now, when you get to, you know, um, the farms, there's one on the front side. I call this the front side and then the back side of it. Um, so this one is actually not in the circle. And there's a guy. Oh, this guy got lit. He might be a decent player, actually. Where'd he go? Is he trying to build? Oh, he's up here. Yeah, yeah. And we'll pick up that snowball because maybe we get to break some of the stuff down. I don't know. But he had bandages, which help us out a lot. We're gonna go ahead and take these real quick. Hold on. And I always try to move when doing that when I can. But it, I mean, some people have their own little things that they do. But we need those bandages for sure. And. uh... But anyways, like I was saying, this quarry right here I'm going to get a little bit at, and then we'll go to the other one and try to grab it, because the circle's going to come in on this one, and I probably won't have enough time. And someone's shooting me. Oh, of course. Where's he? Oh, there he is. Okay, we're going to retreat, because I don't like this spot right here. Hold on. Zigzag. He's bad. Alright. There he is. Come on, bro. If he gets close, I'm using this boogie bomb on him. He can see me through. He thought I was going to go up. Lol. Lol. Trying to get me. Oh, behind me? Really, dude? Oh, there's two people here. Now I'm going to have to scramble. Here we go. Hey, I got to use the wood, yo. Ooh, saved by the wood here. Guy. Boy. Alright. I think we're good right here. Bench up. Alright, this kind of messes up the whole thing. This is our timing thing. So we don't really have enough to make it in-game, maybe. I mean, we might be stretching it, but uh, we're going to need all we can get. Alright, they're fighting each other now, which is great. We're going to go sneak attack, see if we can't take out one of them. We're gonna take out the structure. Get out of there, buddy. There he goes. Boogie bomb, what's up? Yeet! Fuck that. And we got. Oh, we got exactly. We got a bonus. A bonus is the rocket launcher. Holy moly. The RP jizzle. And I'm getting rid of the other one, and I'm taking all the materials I can. So we're not bad. We're 999 wood again, 100 brick, and 100 steel now. So we might be able to get in game with this, but I'm going to go to this other quarry and see if I can't um, pick up some stuff. But first, I don't know if this guy to my right is alive or dead. So we're going to try to get out of here as soon as possible and just try to avoid this fight. We're not really going to try to fight because it's going to take time, and we don't have time. Time is not on our side right now. And uh, we're lucky that was the first zone because if that was the second zone, we would be close to dead. Let's see here. If I can get to this quarry, I feel good. I feel the good. I'm not worried about that chest up there either. I'm just going to keep on rolling. I'm going to have to. I got to pick up some stone ASAP after our bandage. <clears throat> Yeah, this is fun. It's like, uh, it's very nerve-wracking to do this one. Um, this is my third time attempting it. I got second once, and I went for a no-scope because I fell, and it was very close. That would have been an epic, legit game, but, um, yeah, we'll just see. I still gotta go back at the footage. I think I might have hit that guy in the last one, but we'll see. 
if you guys see it on a video, then you know I hit the guy. Uh, if you don't see it, then I might put it on Twitter or something. I don't know. But I'm not worried about people coming around me. I think people are, that guy that was over there was, I think, a pretty bad player. I think I killed a good player out of that three. Me, him, well, <laughs> us, those two. Uh, I'm a bad, I'm a bad player, but, um, I think I killed the good one, the good one, so the bad one's really not gonna mess with me, probably. He's probably too scared. He's probably running through the circle right now. I got work to do. I think we have enough to make it in-game, and we just need to go ahead and run. Uh, we may take a couple rocks on the way, but, uh, I think we have enough to make it in-game now. That's pretty much where you want to be. I love 999 wood, 999, uh, brick, but having a little steel as well helps out. If we can get to 500, we'll be good. I mean, for sure. I'm like, I'm not too worried about it. Okay, <clears throat> now the second part. All right, this is the second circle. So you wanna get as close as you can to the second circle, and once you get close to the second circle, you wanna start building up uh, outside of the circle. So when the circle closes, it hides your actual stairs leading up to the sky bridge. Um, so that's kind of what we're, where we're at right now. We wanna make sure that we get it where no one else can see it, and we're just barely poking up uh, through the the storm so we'll talk about that in just a second when we get there but we got actually a little bit of materials here which i'm pretty excited about we are set and looted we have 15 bandages we have an ar we have a rocket launcher we have a shotgun which i really don't need a shotgun and we have the sniper with 41 bullets and that's way more than you can expect so right here i'm building outside of the circle here and uh the circle will conceal my ramp up now as long as i make this um, ascend to the clouds, then I'm gonna be fine. If no one shoots my stuff, I should be good. This sh this is the hardest part right here, is just getting into the circle. So I'm gonna slow it down here, um, and just kinda wait for the circle. And I should be in. I want a little bit poking out um, of the storm, so I can not be in the storm, but at the end of the day, I, again, you want to conceal, conceal, conceal as much as possible. A lot of people don't look back into the storm, so that's that's really good. That's our main goal. And as you can tell, um, there's not many people left already, so that's good. Now, it's a waiting game. This is probably the most boring part of the whole thing. It's just a waiting game here. We're waiting on the next circle the storm will start shrinking in a minute so um but right now when we're looking at the map and stuff we want to make sure that we're in a straight line and i am in a straight line where i can be inside the circle and not inside the circle um i'm gonna see if i can take my time here and just build up i'm looking for the ceiling of the uh world because there is a ceiling of course that you can only go up so many levels and here it is so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break out this bottom part right here. Make sure you don't break the one you're on, like that. <laughs> and um, I'm gonna build a platform because I know that I can basically go in and go straight ahead, but um, basically that's what we're doing now. We're all platform now. And as you can tell, I have 800 wood, 500 brick, and 150 steel, so we're good to go. And uh, there's a base right there. And see if there's anybody in it. No, nope, nobody's in it. That's good. We want to, I mean, it seems like the people that are in bases usually notice you the most. So if we get a shot on some people, we might take it, but for the most part, we're good to go. We're good to go. But it's just like I said, a waiting game. It's really boring, but uh, the end game is very, very satisfying. <clears throat> but I found a sniper is the biggest key to this whole thing. AR is great. Uh, rocket launcher, I don't know yet because I never had one. An RPG. Um, and we'll see how that plays out in this thing. It may give me away, but so far, so good. But anybody can do this. Good players, bad players, doesn't matter what your skill level. You can do this. All you got to do is get the right materials. And this can help you learn how to build correctly, too. And, you know, it's all good. But I'm good to go. I just gotta build a straight line to the circle and take my time. A lot of people like to take their time on here and just let the storm catch up with you. I'm really not that worried about people seeing me, so I'm just gonna jog it up. But I make sure I'm triple clicking every single one 
because I've been screwed by this game so many times and not clicking the right one at the right time. So I'm not going to click, click, click. I'm going to click, spam it as much as possible. Slow it down here a little bit. There's a guy building on top of the da pot. Dusty Depot. Dusty Depot. Um, hopefully he does not see us. We'll inch in when we can here. Hopefully he gets in a fight with someone else or something. Or he built to get away from somebody or that he saw somebody. I don't know. I'm just going to kind of chill right now. He's our biggest competitor, but here comes the uh, storm. So we'll ride the storm in this thing, so he has a less likely chance to see us. And we're getting close to the edge here. The edge here, and that was probably one too many. I bet it was one too many. Yeah, it was one too many. So we want to be on this one right here that I'm on, not the next one. Uh, we want to barely be sticking out, and this guy, oh, he had, he is in a fight with a guy right beside him. But yeah, this is bad. You don't really want to have that extra piece sticking out. You want to be just like this on mine, and I want to be where they can't see me as well. So if they do look here, look up here, it looks like somebody already broke it off. And we're hoping... This guy, whoever wins this fight, stops to bandage right in the middle of the circle. Right there, where we can hit him. Stop, stop. No, he's building. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to get my rocket launcher and let's just test it. Screw it. See if he even hears it coming. Oh, he built a freaking ceiling, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Bastard. But he don't know where that came from. He's scared out of his mind, I can tell you that. What's one good thing about this next circle is we also have a straight line again. So you can see it in my mini map, you just gotta go straight ahead. Uh, and I'll probably switch over to brick here in just a second. Let's see what these guys do. This guy in the thing, I don't know what he's doing. Oh, okay, he's finally building now. Oh, he's getting shot from this side too. That's great for us because he's not gonna look up anymore. He's running around the back side there. All right, brick it is. All right, we're gonna take our time here. Because we can. And, uh, you know, they got to shoot brick a little bit more. I give this like another two or three shots until we fall, so I like brick. But people don't want to get hit by this one the most, so they're going to be running into the circle. They're probably already in the circle, if not already. So I'm not really worried about people looking up on this one, but I'm, we got to make sure that it is the last one we're in on this one. We can't start messing up this time. I think this one might be the end one, maybe. Maybe one more. I think one more, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, one more for sure. But we'll wait to get, till it gets close. There's only four people left. Holy shit, I didn't even look. Maybe another one? Do I gotta do another one? Come on, stop, 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 stop. Okay, good. Whew. Okay. Three people left. There's that guy. And he just got killed. It's me versus another guy. And I think that's him. That's him. And we're going to wait for him to be still. He's square me. He's probably a good player. All right, buddy. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Be still. Be still. Be still. Nope. He's running. Is he going to go get that dude's stuff or what? Oh, he's trying to get to the circle. He's trying to be the first one to the circle. Exactly what he's doing. He's like paranoid as crap though. Look at him. All right, he's got a little base. I don't like that wall right there, dang. 
Alright. <laughs> Dumbass, he trapped himself underneath. He's gonna have to break it now. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> okay, that's a perfect though. The way it's angled is perfect for us. So he's breaking it. Build another one just like that, dude. We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait this guy out. Hold on. Oh, I hit him. 125? So he's got like nothing left, really. Yes! We did it. We did it. Skybridge challenge. Yes! Yes! That was fun. God, I love that thing. But if you want to do it, all you gotta do is follow those simple rules. Make sure you get 100 wood. Make sure you get 100 brick. Make sure you get some bandages and a sniper rifle and you're good to go. I know it sounds like a lot, but uh, it's really not that bad. I love your face. I hope you leave a thumbs up on this one. And I'll see you guys next time for the next challenge. Peace out.